Wow. That's what I'm talking They're about. They're going hard. Fila, what do you think about this? Welcome to GT Not Live, where today we are back for the mind trip of 2023, Garden of Ban Ban. The series so nice, you have to say Ban Ban twice. Uh, yeah, if, if in case you missed part one of our coverage of Garden of Ban Ban 3, which is the latest game to release in like a, a two month period, who knows? <laughs> These things just like, woo, here they go. Um, it is, it is wild. Uh, if, if there are Sharks to be jumped. I feel like Garten of Ban Ban has jumped all those sharks and continues to find new sharks to proceed and jump over. Um, last time, I, I don't think I can even summarize what happened last time. Like, it, it has to be witnessed to be believed. We found Stinger Flynn, the giant orange, uh, jellyfish, but I don't think any, or, I don't, but I don't think anyone really recognized just how giant this jellyfish actually, like, he is a, a, a behemoth. He's like, like the family friendly Cthulhu and he speaks to you through telepathic means and brings us to his little like beach vacation where he needs to collect kids in order to ascend to the higher level, but he's never touched sunlight before, which is basically the equivalent of never touching grass. I don't know, man. This jellyfish has never touched grass or sand, needs kids to ascend to higher levels. And is just like looking out on the beach with his like buddy, the weird like sack boy ripoff looming in the distance. So I don't know. And, and we, we created a spider girlfriend for the evil spider creature guy. They're like, oh, he's just angry because he's got hormones that aren't being released. And I mean, honestly, like he needs a girlfriend to, to mellow him out. And so we created the girlfriend. And she disappeared, and that's 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 largely where we left things off. Like I said, I we're flashing back in time. We're playing the Stinger Flynn sometimes. It is all over the map. I <laughs> like we, there there have been some weird rides on GT Live over like the the you know half decade that we've been doing this show. There have been some strange games that have taken some weird pivots, and. You know, up to this point, uh, Garten of Ban Ban's been like, yeah, you know, it's a, a weird underground facility that's also kind of part, like, kindergarten or, like, child childcare facility, but they're doing experiments with this, like, alien element, and there, there's, like, this alien component. But now, we're just going off the rails, and, and I believe we're only halfway through it, so who knows what the future may bring, my friends, but uh, Garten of Ban Ban, always an exciting adventure in store. We'll see, we'll see what happens next. Um... So without any further ado, like, so that's my summary. I hope I did well. How'd I do, Ash? I think you did great. I feel like that's simultaneously an accurate, but also I have, usually I'm able to theorize in real time and like, I'm like, I, I get what's going on here. This one has been like, oh, I, I don't know what the giant telepathic jellyfish is trying to tell me in this moment, but I'll have to come back to it and figure it out later. Yeah, I think with this franchise in particular, it's like, typically we just kind of question what's on screen right but this has me questioning myself <laughs> like am i perceiving this correctly <laughs> yeah. like is this happening yeah right it is yeah usually it's like yeah I, I like that that's a great way of summarizing it usually it's like oh yeah let's question what's on screen let's figure it out we can like put these together no this one's questioning my the very core of my sanity like i can't believe what i'm witnessing and i don't know how to process it and i and i feel like i maybe i should maybe i should i don't know I, yeah. I question my internal being. Who am I? Garden of Ban Ban, raising the existential questions that we all need here in 2023. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, without any further ado, I believe, uh, so uh, when last we left off, I think we were slightly past this, but this is a, a good kind of recap. So we just uh, created the um, Nabnalina, I believe was her name. We created Nabnalina, which is the girlfriend for our, our little spider guy here. There's Nabnalina. There's a bright somebody for everybody. You just need to look. So we did that. And so uh, last time we summoned her, at which point they do a little dating ritual out here. And then chaos happens. So 
we just kind of have a, they, they set us back a little bit. So this is spider assembly called stay away from doors and windows. So we get to watch this little mating dance happen. <laughs> I, li I like you adding the sound effects there, Ash. Thank you. This is Ash auditioning for the role of Nab Nalina. Yeah. Taking inspiration. <laughs> Inspo. Look at it, his tongue hanging out there. That's not the way to approach a woman. I'm just saying. Like, that's that's not going to get you a second date. Be a little bit more cool. I, the pendulum-esque movements are especially disturbing yeah, to me. Just like At last, he's no longer miserable. Yay! I'm surprised they both weren't originally members of the mutants below. They'd certainly fit. This is <laughs> And then and then there's like an earthquake or something. Yeah. No! Nabnalina! She runs away! <laughs> okay, so they ran this way. That's all closed. And then there was something over here, right, wasn't there? Party hats. So now what do we gotta do? Where are we going? Oh, ooh, oh, yeah, this cutscene. Something, something. Oh, Stinger Flynn's on loose! What? You have overstayed your welcome here. Sorry, buddy. I even made you an offer, but guess what? Accepting it is long overdue. Don't worry. Made you an offer I won't you can't get refuse. rid of you or collect you just yet. Collect you. I was never one to abide by waste. <laughs> An old friend needs you a lot more than I do. They too are on a path to achieve peace of mind. Achieve peace, my sure. I already have more than enough subjects to move forward with my aspirations and my ultimate mental refinement. <laughs> Again. You just take a little nap while I transfer you to where you're meant to be. <laughs> sure, okay. You just take a nap. It's fine. It's Anything fine. Anything can happen here. Psychic jellyfish. Let's go! Oh, and now we're back in another... Hey, you. You're finally awake. <gasps> and thank you for taking a nap. Feels like we've been in this car forever. <laughs> oh my gosh! So, Singer, this when are we arriving at era. this place called Beach? I believe we are lost. Clearly. Oh, oh look at <laughs> Just marching up. Nice. <laughs> you had one job and you messed that up somehow. I am struggling to locate the being who asked for your opinion. Can you at least put some music on since we're gonna be out here for a while? <laughs> what is. Please let it be life as a highway. Wow. That's what I'm talking They're about. Hard. Pila, what do you think about this? <laughs> awesome. Captain, what about you? Captain. Captain? He's like, I lost my pants. Crank it up. Is that even a quick thing? Okay, decent answer. Can you stop vocalizing for just one second so I can focus on the road? There is no road! What do you mean? There's nothing! The road. We've been going in circles for hours. Never trust a jellyfish. Am I right, Okila? Ah! <laughs> questioning, questioning ourselves. These are those... If your pathetic mouth utters another infuriating okay. sentence, I will stuff your whole body in one of those stupid party hats in your head. Is this real? Is this imaginary? What are you trying to tell me, game? And and, and now we're Stinger Flynn again. Sure. Why not? Because why not? What did we just witness, Ash? You know, um... Is that a flash? Is this a, a flash forward, maybe? I... Like, because Stinger Flynn at one point is like, in, in our first meeting with him, he's like, I've never seen the beach. I've always wanted to see the beach. So is the beach metaphorical? Is that real? Okay, we did this. Hello, what are you? So is there a green? That looked like a green jellyfish now. Like a green tentacle. 
Hello? Hmm. So is this like pre-stinger flint? Is there a secondary jellyfish that can be my friend? Hello? Alright, this is this game, man. Nice, nailed it. And two! Great. Activate! Activate something! Oh, oh. boy. Gameplay! Sorry. I'm... Ooh! Hello, what's down there? Can I check this out? I Like, on one hand, I want to check it out, but on the other hand, I don't want to... Might as well. Oh, more buttons. Oh, jeez. There's a lot of buttons here. Here, before we, before we do more, I want to kind of check out what this is. I'm curious. Is this just a way back? Oh, this is just if you fall. Ooh, hello. Nope! Lies! It's a painting of lies. Okay, here we go. A little bit. Oh, hi. Okay. Okay, it takes a while for you to recharge your, like, electric. Like, I can't just do it there. Yeah, you can't just spam it. Okay. Oh, man, this is gonna be the minigame where it speeds up each time. Great. Got him. Yeah! Next. There we go. This is wonderful. One. Huh. The the tones are interesting. Like, yeah, perfect. Yahoo! Yahoo! I'll take it. Next. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, <laughs> let's not get too excited here, Garden of Bay. Okay, I think I think I've coped. I think I've handled this. Let's let's go. <laughs> let's, let's activate. Nice. Nice. Wow. Okay. Nope. Nope. Hit one I already did. Is there any way to actually like time this? No. No. I think you just gotta like follow your dreams a little bit. Right. I feel like right. Just a, just a hope and a prayer. Yeah! Okay. Oh my gosh, there's one more. Oh, I had it. I see it. There. Yeah! Woo! Got him! Not bad! Not bad! I only missed like, what, two? Three? Not bad. I will take that. <laughs> oh, wow. This, this, wow. This game. This game. How insane. Alright, let's check out what this is gonna do. What you gonna do for me? Yeah, I know you're gonna open that. Did that change anything back here? It just this is a large empty room and there's a big target on that that wall. The fact that there's a target. And we know that this game sometimes like hides secrets when you like go backwards to things. But I guess not. Alright. I keep waiting for like, where's the secret tape? I need the secret cassette tape. But technically we're in Stinger Flynn's memory, so who knows? Who even knows what's going on anymore in this game? Oh. Oh. <laughs> what?! Fade to black. Fade! I will say, the constant fading Sorry, to- you're waking up! I was getting really bored, and that fellow over there isn't much of a talker. Plus, it's scary here. That big green guy keeps checking in on us. I think he believes we're some sort of dolls. We could use that to our advantage to try and escape. He cannot know that we're alive. <laughs> Every time we move or change something in the room, let's make sure that it's back to the way it was before he checks in on us again. Great. This How about way, we not change anything we can in the room? We inch our way towards escaping, all while he doesn't suspect a thing. In other words, from his point of view, the room must remain unchanged. Great. When he's close, the lights change color. So run back to your chair when the lights change. Okay. I don't know where to start though, so you'll give it a try. Thanks, Bamboline. So, what? So helpful. Right? That was that was amazingly helpful, Bambolina. Weren't it? And oh, here's our bud. Here's Bud Nab Nab. So, I, I, are they are they not friends with each other? Or do they not know each other? Bambolina, you helped 
Ban Ban not be crazy. I don't. I don't know. I here's the thing. I need to just stop theorizing about this in real time and just be like, okay. Yeah, you I know, think this we, is like acceptance. Yeah, we just need to accept it. Okay. The super secret Jumbo Josh Lounge. Are you cool enough to enter? Oh. What? Okay, so... So these go just randomly over here. And they fill in... Okay, so we gotta fill these in in the order... Oh, oh jeez. Quick, sit down! He's coming! I thought we were training. I thought we were in training mode. What does sit down mean? Like, get in my chair? Can I look? Oh, oh, I have to hit E. Okay. Hello. Uh, <laughs> I, I didn't get the colors back in the right place. I thought I was still, like, exploring the room. Oh, I'm so dead. No, that's not how the secret club's entrance is supposed I, to be. Yes, I know. I, I'm well aware. Yeah, I'm dead. Ponch. Ponk! R! Did we ever did we ever solve the jumble of letters on the last one? I think I still have that list in my phone. What was it? Cuz cuz this time there's a, it seems like it's going to be a whole new set of letters. Like I'm expecting each one to have a whole new set of letters, so okay. Gray, green. Gray, green. Red, yellow. So when they go back, it would be gray, green, red, yellow. Gray, green, red, yellow. Okay. No. You were cool enough to enter. Ooh, teacup. Okay. Gray, green, red, yellow. Okay. So I got two blocks. What's what's behind here? Okay. So you got to collect. Okay. So we got to collect a bunch of these things. And I shut this this way. Okay, I get it. All right, so the green blocks, we're going to stack to reach things. I'm supposed to collect the orange blocks. And then we're going to use the orange blocks to escape somewhere. I also don't know why end training is a button Quick, when down. it doesn't seem like He's we're actually in training mode. So, all right. I think I, I, think I, I think I understand the concept of this thing now. Wonderful. So this is open, closed. So this is always going to stay open. Because I have not touched that. So it's very... This is this reminds me of uh, growing up in my house in, in Ohio, where my mom was very particular about how the house stayed organized and clean. Are we good? We should be good. Nice. Okay. Here we go. So one, two, three. Whoa. Whoa. What? Uh, can I put mul- mul- can I put multiple of you- nope. Hmm, but you- so I just put- so I have orange blocks to stack on top of other blocks. <laughs> okay, <laughs> all right, sure. Okay, hey. Ah! Oh. Can I- can I do, do a leap? No! Oh, it almost I almost had it. I could just skip I could just skip the puzzle entirely. Yeah! Skipping the puzzles! Look at those leap strats. Come help me solve this equation! No! You What? The the integral of smite What is wrong with you, Bambolina? Now isn't the best time for education? Help me solve this equation. Uh when you integrate Smiley face, you get infinity? <laughs> the area under the curve of happiness is inf infinite. That's beautiful. It's a beautiful thing. That is pretty profound. Right? That, that's deep. Yeah. That's deep. I like that. Okay, so so we definitely uh, cheated our way through one of those puzzles, which I feel a little bit bad about, but also not too bad about. Like, you know, <laughs> look, at the, look at what we're talking about here. I'm fine with this. Uh, okay, so that's gone. So this one is, like, if I put one in, I'm gonna go one, one. Oh, get out of here. It must be on solid ground. To place the gold cubes. Fine, here. Go! One, 
One. One. Great. Okay, got it. And I gotta recover my cubes. Here. I do like the idea of like these these memory puzzles. This is kind of cool. As a as a concept, I like that a lot. So what's inside this one? Just so we could get a preview. Of oh geez. Oh geez. Okay, okay. All right. Well, what do we gotta do with this guy? Hop over it. Okay, this is hop over it. So I'm not gonna. I don't want to get stuck in there before this this pass. What's end train? Can I end training? What's that gonna do? Okay, open, close, closed. I will say that light was not green before. That is not my fault. I'm just paying attention to the details. Just saying. <laughs> Apparently Jumbo Josh is not paying attention to the details either. But yeah, when I was growing up, it was one of those things where you had to know, like I had to know that the the like hot cold on the faucet was always like right dead center. And there were certain patterns on the carpet, like where my mom had vacuumed, especially in the rooms where you're not allowed to go, that you have to make sure that the carpet like fibers are still facing the, the right way and stuff. So I became... Re Let me tell you, became real detail oriented that way, uh, where I paid real close attention to a lot of that that small stuff. So wait here. Uh, where are we at? Hey bud, can I go here? I'm so stuck in here, aren't I? Get it, Jerome. Jerome, where are you, bud? Jerome. Oh man, he's this is, okay. Hey, hey, Jerome. Here. There he is. Activate. Go. Yo! Okay. Great one. Bro, go. Go, go, go. We only have enough. We don't have enough time for this. Go, go, go. Great. That was enough for now, I guess. Again, I don't want to... I don't know where Jerome was in this process. Like, Jerome was not in this room, I feel like. No! Jerome! Get away, Jerome! You weren't in this room! Is he, is he gonna give me in trouble? <laughs> <laughs> the very obvious drone sitting in front of Jumbo Josh. Oh, poor Jerome. What's going on? Oh, Jerome. If you if you rat me out, Jerome, you are dead to me. Pambolina. No! The drone's supposed to be <gasps> off-site! Damn it! Oh no! Jerome! Uh, where the- like in the- in the room? Jerome. Should he be in the room? So- so should I- I should have kept him in the room. I guess. R. Oh, bless you! Oh, bless you, Pikachu! Thank you! Bless you, Pikachu! Shoot, do I have to start it again? Or do I get to keep any of my blocks? <laughs> it would be great if I got to keep my blocks. Just saying. Uh, gray, green. Oh, wait, green. Nope. Gray, green, red, yellow. Oh, I gotta start all over. No! Wow, you gotta do this whole thing. Gray, green, red, yellow. Okay. Jeez. All right, let's do this again. Maybe I can speed run my way through at least some of these. Because these, these two aren't too bad. Okay, here we go, let's go. All right, wait, so that's two. And now we know that Jerome just has to hang out outside of everything. Okay. Does end training do anything? It's just when you've collected enough of them, I'm assuming? Okay, this does not become active until... And, and this guy's just sleeping. He's, he's having a rough day. I understand, man. Bambolina, you're tall. Can you literally help in any way, shape, or form, or no? Quick! Sit down! He's coming! Got it. Been there, done that. But yeah, it was it was the sort of thing where, like, I had my bed, right? And a lot of my video games were stored under my bed. And when my mom would, like, clean the room or whatever, it would have certain, like, vacuum patterns. And so she would know... Like there was, a, I was really good at playing this game and knowing like exactly how to hang up the the towels and this and that to make sure that everything was precise all the time. But then there was that moment where, okay, is there? But there was always this moment of. So, real quick, what's up? Is oh, he's trapped. Who's trapped? 
my little, little orange guy. My little orange guy. Well, this yeah. is the guy I got before. But there was always, um, but there was that moment where my mom's like, I know. Hey, come help me solve this equation. Oh, let's equation. see solving the equation again. But she's like, oh, what did you get from under your bed? And I'm like, how'd you know I was under my bed? Because I put everything, like, right. I knew that everything Maybe was all lined up. And, uh, you know, I'm like, oh, it, it was the box was lined up alongside the, um, like, the, the bed post or, like, the, the foot of the bed and things like that. So I'm like, how, how did you know that I was in there? She's like, oh, I saw it in the carpet. I'm like, oh, no. And that's how I knew. I'm like, oh, oh, shoot. So we were playing a very, a very different game. Close. Close call. Okay, everything's, everything's back to normal. I have a feeling I might need that to solve a puzzle or something. Okay, Jerome. Activate. Where you at, bud? Good. Yeah! Nice. Here. Can I stack up multiple of these? I still can. Uh, it's just one per. Very random. Did I hit that one? Oh, come on. Jerome, can you hit this guy? I would assume that. Oh, this one. Let's, let's just try one of these. One of these has got to work, right? Oh, that one's way too high. There. Is there more stacking you want right? to Right? I do? feel like there's got to be more stacking. Uh -huh. All right. Here, we're, we're taking too long in here. Go! <laughs> the orange stacked cube, is that, was that there? Oh no! Oh no! No! Oh no! 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 Get the orange thing! No! 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 Damn it! You're so right! Shoot. God! Come on! Let me out! I have time! I have time! The Let me fix my like... mistakes! No! The orange cube wasn't supposed no, to be there! Those orange squares you placed weren't there originally! They weren't there originally! Punch! All right, we'll be, we'll be back. All right, Matt. Garden of Ban Ban. <laughs> I, I, yes. Okay, and training, what have we done? Have we won? Is they, are we a winner? Did I, am I winning, son? Did we do it? Yeah, we made it. Got past the jumbo, Josh. Solitary. Oh, to the captains. They're so cute. They're adorable. Those little precious beads. Oh, oh. <laughs> Bambolina. Who says this isn't a horror game? Oh, do you see like she's got those stitches back there? <laughs> Must mean she's a snitch. <gasps> As I hear, snitches get stitches. Yeah, and she has multiple. She does she has a lot. Yeah. So she she'd be snitching all up here. Tape? Lore! L-O-R-E. Capital, oh, here we go. Oh, back to our cleaning place, nice. Look at how beautiful this floor is. We kept it so pristine after last time. Great job, us. Van Belina, where are you going? Where, where are you going, girl? Where are you going? Going up? Oh, 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 oh. oh. Oh, oh, okay. Well, well, hopefully I didn't, hopefully I didn't have to hop on that one. <laughs> Bye. She's like, see ya. Bambolina out. Peace, y'all. What the? I mean, this is the Opila Birds playground. Is that an Opila? No, that's a little kid. Or like a, was that one of the captains? Yeah, it like looks the like the captain doing like right? leg raises. Yeah, right? He was doing like his little Pilates. Yeah. Doing little leg flutters there. Boop, 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 working on those lower abs. Love that for him. Yeah, good for him, man. Way to, way to not skip ab day. Those lower abs, easy to overlook. They Make are. sure you counterbalance that though with some, some lower back workout on the other side. Ooh. Otherwise you're going to be imbalanced. You don't <laughs> want that. No one wants that. No. No, certainly not. Doing a, doing a classic Blogilates Cassie Ho workout right there. Good for you. Yeah. You, you get those gains. <laughs> or losses, whatever you're going for, you know. <laughs> Alternate with some Chloe Ting and you're set. Right? Oh, man. What a, what a quality workout experience. So I got this green card. And if I recall correctly, uh, the green card was connected to the, what, Progressive Center over here? Um, which was... Right, with flow. With, with flow, yeah. Yeah. Progressive flow. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So let's <laughs> let's check out that. That's what I'm assuming I'm supposed to. Oh, did that texture just pop out? 
There was Surprise a Surprise texture. <laughs> Boom! We you least expect it. Just like that cactus in the middle of the desert that they hit in the, their little car ride. Yeah. Hat. I feel like I've collected this hat six times in the course of the last video and a half, but sure. We'll just roll with it. What do we got here? Wow. Oh, Opila bird. No. Tarta bird. Not to be... Very important distinction here. The roster of characters just gets deeper and deeper. Tarta bird says, protect your loved ones. They love you back the same. Oh. Thanks. Case update. We got uh, case number 13, alias the jellyfish. Today marks the first day that Case 13 was introduced to its human genome donor, and the results were not what was expected. In clear contrast to what occurred during the revelation day of both Cases 6 and 7, which resulted in complete meltdowns, uh, Case 13 assured the original genome donor that it was aware that of what it was in its typical calm manner. He's like, fade to black, we're going to enter into a, a very random gameplay sequence. Uh, this is despite having described identical events to what Case 6 has described regarding their bodies, such as an unexplicable immense pain that persists across their entire bodies as well as sharing similar physical attributes such as body growth and the presence of many large veins. Oh! So the veiny design isn't just like a, a weird wonky texture. That is a that is a feature. That's not a bug, my friends. That is a feature of Garden of Ban Ban Creations. You too can get the plush. I like that the, the plush I'm sure is already out or on its way where it's like oh, oh I love it. It's pulsating veins, mommy. I love feeling the aorta. It's great. Mm. Now with pulsating vein action. I, I imagine it as a 90s like cartoon ad and you're like, you have like the little pump tube and you can fill it with like the ooze. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> mm. Now pulse, uh, Jumbo Josh now with pulsating vein power. <laughs> oh, he's full of goo. Oh, stop, stop, <laughs> yeah, Matthew. This, yeah, this is a bad one. It's getting worse. <laughs> <laughs> We await management's decision regarding the risks of presenting a case that is this intelligent and unpredictable. This guy seems the most predictable of all of them. Here, we got a QR code. What do we got this time? Oh, this... So, I can tell you already, this is just Jumbo Josh. Like, um... I, I, I can do the picture of it. So, last time, you'll notice that we did a bunch of these, uh... You know, we had to just bump up the exposure on these... And I can do this really quickly, but you can already tell that this one is just Jumbo Josh. So it's not super, like, mysterious. Like, I don't know what's going on with this one. No, this one, now that we know that each of these is a character, I believe this is Jumbo. Right, Jumbo Josh has got the big old round teeth. Right, right that's Jumbo Josh? Yeah, it should be. It should be. It looks like it looks like the same size and shape of its head. Unless we're missing something crucial. Unless, yeah, unless, there, unless there's someone else, but I feel like this is pretty much him. So, anyway, wanted to show you that one. There we go. So we're doing well. So, we okay, we got Tarta Bird. We got some math. I like basic mathematics. That's fun. Always, always stand me some basic math. Uh, we've got... I still got a green key card, so I should be able to open this, right? Hello! Oh, hey. I don't trust you. <laughs> no. I I say no to you. But he is just so cute. I oh. Oh! oh. Yeah. Oh, it is, it is a trap. In the in the iconic words of Admiral Akbar, it's a trap. I see you. I see you, bird. How to tame a giant angry bird, achieve high ground, jump and land on back, interact midair. You <laughs> great. Press E key mid air. Sure. E. Uh, e. Okay, so we gotta maybe get up there somehow. Tarta bird is hanging out up there. Can I jump? I cannot. Okay. Ah. Uh, oh, I get it. So he's up there. That's why. And so he's gonna pounce on me as soon as I do that. So we don't wanna. We don't want any of that action. So what have we learned here? Oh, it's math. Okay. So oh. egg plus egg plus egg is three. So egg is one. Uh, so it's what? Apila bird is probably three minus one. Oh, oh no, two. So Apila bird is four, and Tarta is two, and egg is okay. Two, four, one. This is one. This is two. This is four, five. And this is four, three. And then this is they were two, so that's four. I like that it's just math. Uh, one. 
three and four. Nailed it. Math! Love it! Basic math puzzles! Sign me up. Wahoo. Hello. What are you? <laughs> Get out of here. Come on, Hello? man. <laughs> Come on. Mr. Kebab Man says... It's Mr. Kebab Man! Hey! Oh, it's me, Mr. Kebab Man! Be yourself no matter the cost, unlike me. <laughs> Mr. Kebab Man! Yay! It's like your uncle. The uncle that comes to the, like, 4th of July barbecue. Yeah. Yo, me, Mr. Kebab Man, pull my finger! <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Oh, you gotta love me, Mr. Kebab Man! You know me! Mr. Kebab Man! Oh, Uncle Kebab Man! Yay! So yeah. happy to see you! Yo! <laughs> Let me tell you how things, what things are like in Jersey! <laughs> hey, Mr. Kebab Man. It should not be moved without its costume. Hello. This is an animatronic. This is, this is, ba <laughs> this is basically what? Like an endoskeleton? Yo, Mr. Kebab Man! Don't move me until I got my costume on, which I'm assuming are the party hats. I, I, I feel like I have a couple party hats. Can I? Okay. Cannot be moved. All right, let's go. <laughs> what the heck? What is this game? What, what is this? Uh, yeah, a, a child spirit has been shoved inside the endoskeleton here of, of Mr. Kebab Man. Mr. Kebab Man. <laughs> Mr. Kebab Man. He's Mr. my- Mr. Kebab Man. Yeah. Oh, hello. Oh, he, that's just the sign. He ha He's serving me Music Man energy. In like the way that you would say the name, or just, just in just power, in, like in in terms of like what a random character, yeah, like like in a like what 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 has happened here, yeah, like, Music Man, Mister Kebab Man, it doesn't work, it's yeah, too many too many syllables. You got to change the cadence. Yeah, it's like Kebab Man, Kebab Man. I don't know, I can't, the jelly. We'll workshop. Yeah, we'll we'll work on it. We'll work on it. Uh, let's see this case number thirteen again. Update two, uh, hands-on testing with Case 13 has started, started and deemed very promising. Case 13 is even capable of fu fluent speech. Primitive instincts and proneness to unwarranted hostility that were previously observed in cases seems to be completely absent from Case thir 13 if accidental stinging is to be disregarded. However, aggressiveness can still be presented when Case 13 is provoked or when any of its questions go unanswered. Aggressiveness never involved excessive violence or fatalities, despite Case 13 being completely aware of its impressive physical strength. So it just makes everyone pass out. Current testing involves introducing Case 13 to basic human etiquette, such as shaking hands without stinging. The following phase of testing will involve informing Case 13 with its mission. With its mission. At this rate, Case 13 should be just as ready for the upcoming Bring a Friend Day as Case 12G. Case is not ready for presentation. Here we go. Who do we got this time? Hey, oh, Mr. Kebab Man! Mr. Kebab Man! Oh, let's go shrimp on the Barbie! This is just, um... This is just Nab Nab, I believe. Just so, just... I'm gonna do it, but I believe this is just Nab Nab. You went good. Here we go, adjust. We're going exposure. With that flappy tongue, sharp pointy teeth, round sharp pointy teeth, that like uh, spindly arm in the back. Yeah. Right? Is that that's Nab Nab? Yeah, I think Little so. Little spider guy. Yeah. Spider. He's got he got that like gelatinous tongue that's waiting to flop around. Ew. Just flaccidly flop around. <laughs> now with real flaccid powers. <laughs> yeah, it's so loose and floppy. <laughs> Powers, huh? Look at look at the look at that bulbousness of the tongue. Ugh. <laughs> oh, wow. the worst adjectives. But... <laughs> what is all these doors? What the heck? Okay, rocket. The tongue. Tongue. Rocket tongue. Rocket tongue. Call to activate button to get rocket. Okay. Is this a boss battle? I don't like this. Does 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 Garden of Ban Ban Three think it's gonna have a boss battle? <laughs> it might. Hey, it might. Yeah, hey, yeah. Reach for greatness. Here we go. Okay. Oh man. Oh man. 
Oh man, are we are we doing this? Oh, we're doing this! Oh wow! <laughs> oh, it's paper mache. Okay. Oh, oh, he's, he's okay. He's charging up his back. Or something. Oh, hello. That's oh. the tongue. Okay. Well, that's a thing. Hello. This is this is a cool music check. Are you gonna attack me? Okay. Okay. He's he's spitting. Okay. So. Okay, so we got us. Okay, so he's yeah. Okay, he's winding up something. Okay, so you want to prompt? Okay, so you want to prompt an attack here. Hit it! Hit it! Hit it! Hit it! Okay. Okay, he's winding up the old loogie bomb. Okay. Yeah. If, if video games have taught me anything, it's you, you prompt the attack and then run away. Okay, so I want him to do another loogie attack. So he's turtle. Co he's a turtle chameleon, basically. Come a come a come a come a turtle chameleon. Okay, so now he's gonna do another tongue. I'm assuming. Okay, so when I'm on here, he does a tongue. Okay. So we hit this. Oh, and there's our rocket. All right. So now we want to put it on the tongue. So we want to. Okay, we want to prompt a tongue attack. Jump here. Then like put it on the tongue. Nope. Hmm. How do I get it on your tongue, or launch it at your tongue, or what? What, what exactly is going on here, friendo? Curious. Can I stay here? Or is this gonna kill me? Okay, oh. that's gonna kill me. Okay, that's good to know. That's force. Right, it is violence. And even though you're not in the line of trajectory, so being in the vicinity of the platform will kill us. That's good to know. All right, just that was an experiment that was worth running, and now I'm glad I did it. Now I'm curious where it's. Is, does it just spawn me at the top of the battle? Where are we at? Good, okay, great. Okay, you're here. Jerome. Oh, oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. I wasn't ready for this. I wasn't ready for this! Okay. Oh. I, I, I was not. The battle started sooner than I expected, okay. Unprepared! Do you think the T stands for tongue? No. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and? No. 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 I would, I would almost certainly say no look there are improv rules that say yes and but sometimes it's just funnier to say no yeah right okay here okay here he goes with the tongue so he's launching the tongue okay okay where's my where's my boy at and where is the first thing that i'm supposed to activate is it is it gonna be in the same order ah. that's a kind of tight window actually to do that okay there we go yo me mr goodbye man oh, jerome jerome <laughs> Question your life decisions, Joe. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, you're gonna, gonna do the fake tongue. So this one doesn't have a middle ground. Okay. Beep. Gonna warm up tongue? Okay, tongue. Oof. Okay, so now can I do this? Oh, oh. Oh, okay, that hit him. That hit him. Great. Oh, what? Oh, wow. That hit him. That was a thing. We have successfully hit him. Okay. I guess. It was very, very unclear what had happened in that moment, but I, I think we did it. Okay, so now I want the spitter guy to. Okay, spit, spit, spit. Yo, let's go. I'm assuming you can't hit me as long as I'm moving. Come on, Jerome. Okay, here we go. I want the spitter. Okay, wait for him to activate. Activate Lugi attack! Go! Okay, Jerome. Nice. Okay, where's that rocket? Where is that? Okay. Oh shoot, here comes a Lugi attack. Go! Okay, great. <sighs> nice. Excellent. Okay, activate tongue. So you really gotta okay, jump. Smack. Schmack. Schmack to schmack. Tongue. Boom, baby! Nice. Got him. Get over there, Joe. Oh, jeez, he's- Whoa. Oh, oh, he's going fast! Oh, he, he angry now. Okay, speed speed ramped up there a little bit. That's fine. Attacks are coming fast and furious in this Garden of Banban boss battle. Okay, he's going again. Can I- can I- who's, who's active? Oh, oh, man. Oh, I can't. I thought it was gonna be one on each platform. I guess not. Oh shoot. Oh no! Oh, oh, oh no! Oh no! Oh no! 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 Windows button! You are my arch nemesis! 
Oh no! With those buttons! What have you done? Damn it. Oof. Oof. Big oof. Wind up. Oof. And the bitch. You're right too. There we go. That one's got it. Ooh. Boom, baby. I don't know what attack I like avoiding more. Maybe not the tongue, because the tongue is like makes the whole screen shake. <laughs> but I also don't know where the loogie's happening at any given point in time, so that kind of makes me nervous. Okay, it's the far side again. Because of course it is. It's never the side that I'm on, it's fine. Okay with that. Button close up there again. Right, I know, they love I, this side. Give me some spice. Really want us to see this side of the board. Go for it. Okay, wind up. Wind okay, your body button. up. Uh, uh. attack. I like the chill vibes of this. This is like a this is like a lo-fi boss battle. Yeah, it is weirdly kind of chill. Right? For being like you're fighting against the giant turtle chameleon. It's like oh no, this is this is this is chill vibes to study and relax to right now. It's happening. This is like lo-fi girl and the cat just hanging out. Yep, that's lo-fi girl and her cat. <laughs> Boom! Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, 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 wow. Oh. <gasps> oh, wow. I like that he, I like that he plopped and died. And then <laughs> from the depths, just a plank of wood. Like, whoa, a plank of wood. Physics just... sure did physic <laughs> in that moment. Right. Standing up on his two legs. Oh, that was, that was precious. That was delightful. Wow. So <laughs> secure. And all of that was for two party hats! Who could ask for anything more? Right. It's a hat for you and a hat for me. Wait, wait. I know there's lore over okay. in the corner. I see, don't worry. Oh, I see the lore. Ooh. So that's the guy from the depths, the yeah. weird face guy. We've got the two, the turtle chameleon, which we just defeated, and someone new. Who looks like a cross between a ninja turtle and Huggy Wuggy. I was about to say the exact same thing. <laughs> right? Like, yes. really? Huggy Wuggy meets Ninja Turtle. Like, Donna Tuggy. Don Donna Tuggy. Donna Tuggy. <laughs> I kind of love that. Donna Tuggy. Because he's got the purple mask, so that's how you know he's Donatello. Donna Tuggy. There it is. The, the merch item waiting to be had. So what now? We have to jump on a bird's back? Well, I think we have to see what Mr. Kebab Man has to say about that. Because we got Miss the two hats. So the two hats oh. are Mr. Kebab Man's costume. Right. Costume. <laughs> it's, it's, you know. Yes. Generously said. That I'm was with right. you. That was, that was an okay boss battle. You I'm know what? You. I, I, was I was giving uh, Garden Band Band a little bit of a hard time. I was, it, it functioned. I've seen worse boss battles. I've seen better. It's great. It's fine. Here we go. Mr. Kebab Man. Here we go. One. Two. Now what? Erase stones with one bird. So are you gonna attack the bird? Oh my bird? gosh. What are you gonna do? <laughs> God. Behave <laughs> or get banned banned. Hell yo, I meant to come on, man! Hand over your Great. Hand over your pancreas. I don't know how Behave to feel about that. Get ban, ban. But it's there. Behave or get banned. Re recite the pancreas line. Behave or get no. Ban, ban. Behave or get banned. Ban. Is it? Hand over your pancreas. <laughs> it's a good delivery. Hand over your pancreas. <laughs> Hand over, over your, your pancreas. pancreas. Why is this not open and how do we open this? This is very clearly... This is very clearly a door that at some point I should be able to open. Ben, ben. It feels like. Maybe I need to keep going. But this door is sus. Given some major sus vibes. Ooh, and there's... You could also see a key card in there. Yeah. Yellow. Hmm. Hand over your pancreas. Three stones with one bird. Hand over your pancreas. Oh, wait. I haven't checked out this, have I? Well, first off, is there anything under here? 
Like uh, anytime there's like a, a stairway or something that's kind of suspicious. What do we got over here? This, okay, nothing. Literally nothing. Okay, cool. Oh, oh, hey, whoa, both of them are up there. That's good to know. Behave or get banned down. Three stones with one curve. Behave or get banned down. Okay, I'm assuming if I act, are you gonna like lure them? Is that what we're doing here or what? Okay, 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 okay. Cool. Oh, oh no! So now, hmm. Shoot. Shoot. Okay, so we missed our opportunity to do whatever we need to do over there. Oh, hello. 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 Hi. Hi. Hello. Keep running. Hello. Hi. Oh, oh, hello. Can I grab you? Okay. So now what? I, I have a, a presumably, okay, at some point I'm gonna have to achieve the high ground. Okay. Achieve the high ground. Jump and oh, hello. Oh, oh, oh. Jump! Okay, nope, no, nope. That, I didn't feel good about that jump, I gotta admit. I did not achieve enough high ground in that moment. Oh, jeez. Oh, geez. oh, okay! God. Oh my gosh. I thought I had enough room there. Clearly did not. That's fine. S stands Insert for war. stealing birds. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's it. Yep. S stands for pancreas. Yeah, it's actually it's the last the, letter. It's the, S, it's the yeah, pancreas. Hmm. Behave or get banned. Okay, this is the last stop before. Open sesame. <gasps> Yo! Yes! Lord Master Max! Yeah! Oh, we got white card. Where? Oh, awesome! That's great. Where was the white? I don't remember seeing any white things anywhere. Where where would a white card be used? Hmm. I'm trying to think through everything we've been through. Toadster's jail. Maybe in some of like the the memory sequences and stuff. Where's this white? Unless it's something we haven't done yet. And and we'll just unlock the like a secret white door at the very end. Hand over your pancreas. Maybe in the medical center. Oh, there was a wasn't there a green door in the medical center at one point? Hmm. Hand over your pancreas. Behave or get banned. Banned. Interesting. Where could the law secrets be? I would like some more law, please. Law secrets. Okay, to Jumbo Josh and all them. Here's white. Bambolina? Nope. Hmm. None of these really had opening things. And then the training room. We opened everything in the training room. Solitary. But we can't get into, like none of these open. None of these have activations. So, I mean, we're over here, I'm just gonna keep checking it out, but I don't think that this is the case. Oh. Okay. This is the room where we were doing all the... For the Jumbo Josh Club? Yeah, this is the Jumbo Josh one. How Jumbo do you think Jumbo Josh really is? You know, similar to everything else in this game, really fluctuates. Like, honestly. <laughs> I've seen him the size of the giant, like, elevator, but we've also seen him peeking through kind of a relatively small window. Yeah. He's been the size of a hallway at various points. He's like Elastigirl in that way. Yeah, able to kind of, like, manipulate. Well, it depends on how much ooze is pulsating through his bulging veins. I am begging you. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I, I had to throw that one in there for you. No, that's, that's fair. That's par for the course. Had to do it to him. You're just standing on the sidewalk with your hands. So, white. I guess it's either medical center? Medical center or the like Stinger Flynn aquatic arboreal section. Again, all the lights at like low angles and, oh wait, in Stinger Flynn's, isn't there, wasn't there a locked door behind Stinger Flynn's like telepathic speaking station? Oh, was it? If I remember right. Like, because we went up there and we're like, oh, there's something behind Stinger Flynn's cell. 
But then you end up going into the like the telepath, like talk to Stinger Flynn, and he teleports you away with your first fade to black. So I think huh. actually it's gonna be back here. Now that I'm old, now that I'm remembering all the insanity that has been this chapter of the game. Let's see. Open sesame. See, Mr. Kebab Man. He that that's why he and I get along. Oh. He understands the lore. Yeah. He understands the importance of all this. Yeah, that door. <laughs> Very large empty room without the giant jellyfish that also is somehow able to fit into a car <laughs> during whatever dream sequences. <laughs> what is this game? So these Bam Bam games are getting like longer and longer. Like there's they more are. with each release. Well, and I mean, here's here's the thing that you can definitely tell with this one. And the reason why there's so many like fade to black slash dream sequences is they they're like how <gasps> we can use there it is we can use previous Ooh. segments of the game but like reskin them in different ways. Wait, Man Man's Kindergarten is this like the? Oh. Here we go. Tamataki says. We carry our home wherever we go. It's totally worth it. Oh, I like him. That's cute. Kam Kamataki says, practicing safety saves lives. Practice safety everywhere. Oh, they're so cute. They are really cute. I kind of love them. I love them so much. Case 22, type 6. Type 6. Divanium Cloy. All right. That's what the lore says. Case number 1. Case type one, update number 41. So we're deep into this one. Symbol, huh, symbol GV. So is all Jivanium coming from this guy? Oh. This update report will serve as a follow-up to the concerns of the recently discovered phenomenon internally, genome cloy. All research regarding this subject has been conducted on undisclosed cases. Registered cases remain uninvolved. In short, it was found that when a subject's system is overloaded with different genomes, the body will enter an irreversible state in which all but one genome are set to circulate through the body, with the rest all getting disposed of. This reveals the critical necessity of ensuring that each case receives its genomes from no more than three sources donors, lest we're all left with cases that are permanently animalistic and wild, with absolutely no place in a kindergarten. I like that they're still trying to maintain the facade of this was a kindergarten at some point. The genome that gets preference in a genome cloy event remains to be discovered, but it's been theorized that it's what, if they said the word, that it's whatever genome is most different from the rest. Studies on GV continue. Huh. That's very interesting. In short, it was found that when the subject system's over, so now we're getting the sense of like, okay, they're mixing up multiple genomes. Any more than three and the whole thing kind of falls apart. Otherwise, they're permanently animalistic and wild. So everything is a mix of two or three things. Huh. And, it, and it's interesting that the symbol here is GV, so Jivanium here. And it's the same color, like the Jivanium color of that kind of like uh, tealish or kind of like aquamarine is the same color as this guy. Is also, you know, the color that's being used in all of this. Huh. I mean, in Cloy, so it's like a hybrid, like mixing everything together. The lore is getting interesting, Ash. I feel I like know. I feel like this was a, I feel like this was a big reveal. Yeah, this is cool. I like that the A just subtly has a nose in it. Meh. Never really appreciated that. Okay, so there we go. Now let's make the incredibly long run all the way back to where we're supposed to be okay. with the Opila birds. We might want to cut. Yeah, we might want to do that. So we have the screen card now, which opens up this as well. Since we're kind of making the tour. <gasps> a hat! Hey! <laughs> if management sense of humor is this bad, then no wonder this establishment is having difficulties running a kindergarten. They waste God knows how much resources on a prank room like this for employees to find and then complain about financial difficulties. Even worse, it's only found on the day the world ends, so it couldn't even get out couldn't even get out the few laughs it was supposed to get. If we survive this, someone else needs to control our budget's priorities. But then again, whoever set this up is probably gone already, so this would have be, ha, would have to be done anyway. Wait, what if this entire thing is a prank by management and everyone is actually okay? This is my chance to become popular around this place and I'd better not waste it. Okay. 
You got a hat. So... Is this, an, is this in case number order? That would be my guess. What else? I'm trying to think if there's anything else in like the environment that might suggest something else. Do we know? It, I th it must be case number order. That would be, that's gotta be it. So we know that uh, six is Ban Ban. Right. We know that seven is Bambolina. Yes. Who are all these guys? Jumbo Josh was... I thought Jumbo Josh was early. Snail was early. See, shoot, I wish I had the... Here, um... Here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull up a quick, like, Wikipedia, because I'm at, at one of, like, a fan wiki or whatever. Uh, okay, I figured it out. I got it. You got it? Yeah, I got it. So... What it is, and, and this goes back to something that I called out in the previous episode and had forgotten about, but I, I opened up my phone and, and, I, and I saw that the, the nab nab has a one on it. So all of the QR codes that you are scanning throughout the, this chapter on all the lore bits, they all had a number on them. And so Jumbo Josh's is five, nab nabs is one. So that's what it is, is... All of those secret, and you had to turn up the exposure on them all. So it's so it's one, two, three, four, five, six, and then you, and you recognized everyone. There it is. What? Yeah, buddy. Yeah, I pulled it up. I'm, I'm like, wait a minute, what's that five in the corner? Oh, yeah. I remember. That's it. I remember you bringing that up right last time. Yeah, that's yeah. what it was. Awesome. I started doing my own research on the side regarding our decision. We really should have thought this through better. We didn't think about any long-term consequences. We are very selfish. He was never going to be normal. And assuming we could even get him out of this place with this his size, what was next? What house would he fit in? What school would accept him? What government would allow us to keep this abomination around? Let me answer you, none. We haven't even seen what he's capable of when he's scared or angry. I don't even want to imagine the consequences. Not to mention how dangerous it is to keep him around those other monstrosities. He plays with them like they're toys, throwing and commanding them around and everything. Sometimes life denies you beautiful gifts, and we should have accepted that. But we're doing the right thing here, and I'm proud of us both. Hmm. So... Is that talking about the, the weird creepy head face? Maybe. Did but they also, like, Jumbo, didn't Bambolina say something really similar about Josh? Where it's like, he thinks we're toys. Yeah, they did say that, didn't they? Yeah. Yeah. Right. Oh, yeah, that's right. Because, oh, make sure that you go back in place because he thinks we're dolls. He thinks we're toys. So, yeah, it's one, It's about one of the Jumbo guys. It, it could be Jumbo Josh. It could be the, the weird, like, creepy face guy. But, and so, is this, is this classic indie horror game trying to bring a kid back to life? Sometimes uh -oh. life doesn't, or or maybe we couldn't have a kid, and so we created our own. Oh no! Is that what's is that what's going on? Is this classic kid stuff? We're bringing kids back to life, making kids something. No. It's, it it no. seems like it. Sometimes life denies you beautiful gifts. That's that sounds like it might be it. If there is anything even remotely close to remnant, I'm gonna riot. J Jivania, like that's been that's been remnant this whole time, man. No. No, let me live in denial. No! Please. What's this? What? Assembly called practice emergency protocol. What? Unas what? Unrecognized assembly called practice emergency protocols. What? Uh-huh. What happened? What? Oops, sorry. Wait, what happened? Something happened. What's going on? Where should I go? I feel like this would have opened, maybe like opened this door. Or like, did it call someone from over here? I mean, maybe back to Stinger Flint. Oh, hey! Oh, oh, oh. there it is. Hey. Oh. Hey, bud. For what? I'm sorry. What, what, 
Oops. Sorry about I, there, I bud. I don't like you leaning in. Right? I was going to say. I don't like Hey, Moonface. What, what's going on, man? We met your turtle buds. Your turtle chameleon. Your tarmelian. No, that's it. I'm sorry. What does the bottom of you look like? Right? What? What are you? How's the beach these days, by the way? The beach. So yeah, you... he was there. He was there. He was at the beach. He was like the sun at the beach. What are you? I am still... Okay, so I get... Yeah, that's what we were supposed to see is him just popping up and saying, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sorry not... Hashtag sorry not sorry. Huh. I think... I think that's everything. I feel like that's... Hey, bud. You, so you're just hanging out these days? Wait, can I like... Go, Jerome! There he is. Go, Jerome! Oh, Jerome. Jerome. Come, let's, we gotta have a serious talk. I Go. think we've all had our Jerome days. Jer Jerome tries his best, man. Can I, can I contact? Can I go to you? Right into the nose. Go into the face! Okay. Come on, Jerome. You got it. Go. What? Ooh, can I see around the side of you? Ooh. Ooh. So he is kind of like... Huh. Bye. Good talk. Good talk, creepy face guy. Good talk. Glad, glad we had this, uh, this moment of lore bonding right here. Still not sure why you're apologizing, but yeah. we'll get there. Right. It's all right. You know what? I forgive you for whatever it is you did or didn't do. Oh, Chances wow. are it was probably, you know, probably not your fault, I would assume. This way. Go to the medical center. Lay. Oh, progressive center. Is he still hanging out, my bud? Huh. We gotta jump on this bird. Right, yeah, yeah, excuse me. Mr. Uh, yeah, now that we've done, uh, so I, I'm glad that actually, I'm, I'm glad that we discovered the one, because that reminded me that we, there was that green card that we were still missing over there. But now that we, I feel like we've picked up a, a couple of good lore secrets, we gotta hang out with our bud Kebab Man some more. Who literally is just a character straight out of a Mick, Rick and Morty episode. Let's be honest. Yo, it made me with the Kebab hey, Man. Forget Ben Ben. Hand over Three your pancreas. With one bird. Behave or get banned. Ban. Oh, I've Behave missed you in my life. Or get banned. Ban. All right. Okay, he's not close enough. We need one more. Three stones with one bird. Okay. Okay, so. Come on. Come over here. Come over here, my little bird friend. There we go. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Okay. So now I, I was up here. <laughs> Please let this work. Okay. Oh. Okay, so he's gonna jump down. Yeah! We achieved the high ground. Okay. Oh, hello. Oh, oh, oh okay. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. Sure. <laughs> what? Activate. Empty, Empty my hand. hand. First. Uh. Aw, aw. That's adorable. That's that's pretty precious. I gotta say, that is that is really adorable. Life comes at you fast. I don't know what's going on. Great. Okay. Bird riding is a new one. What is stinger? What is this? It drives you forward so vigorously. I refuse to accept that it's your protective character instinct. I mean, I, I, it could be, it though. Could, yeah. Like, it could very well be. Someone has given you false hope. Promised you what you want when all along they had one thing on their Oh, oh hello. Pink faces. <laughs> At first, I was confused by how... Still leaning in on the pancreas stuff, sure. ...in your favor, despite you never being here before. Perfectly in my favor, yeah. And then it hit me. Someone has to have been guiding you. And as with most things, I was right. It did have help. It doesn't really seem like anyone's been helping. Your friend me. here has helped me tremendously. This guy knocked me over the head. Thanks to him, I bore witness to very vital information. Oh my gosh. Everything you say, Stinger Flynn, I don't what understand. <laughs> Man, I can't wait for the game theory on this game. <laughs> Just the... Yeet! I 
will simply prevent myself from turning into what he turned into. Oh! <gasps> Oh, hello. W to speed up, S to slow down. What? What? Okay. We're going. W to speed up, S to slow down. Okay. Wait, wait, okay. B b race rule one. Blue light, I come first. Pink light, he goes first. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh. oh, jeez. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. What? Race rules. Okay. Speed up, speed up, speed up, speed up. Speed up, speed up. It's basically, Ash, you should be doing- Oh, he's chasing ah! us. So basically, Ash, you should be doing this one because this is basically just running the teleprompter. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it is. S to speed up, W to slow down, like, smash the button, smash the button, smash the button, smash the button, smash the button! I'm so experienced in that, actually. Right, this, I was going to say, this is the game that all your training has been leading up for, Ash. Yes. This is it, right here. Finally. <laughs> all those shorts. Because let me tell you, doing all those shorts is not for the revenue that they generate. No. So clearly it was for the Opila Bird race <laughs> in the end of Chapter 3 Ban Ban. And I couldn't even be the one to do it. <laughs> you, can, you can encourage me. You can teach me your ways. Okay, here we go. He's, he's, he's still kind of far away. We're doing all right. Okay, oh, oh, oh. Yep, ooh, keep hitting that W. Okay, W, all about yep. the dubs. All yep. about the dubs. Take the dub. Take the dub. Okay, ooh, slow, 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 slow. Oh, Matt, Matt's off, off book for a little bit. He's stumbling across a couple words. Yep. Oh, oh I'm, yep. I'm doing good. I, I know my words. Yep. Oh, he's, he's speeding through this section. Oh, he's hitting the loop. He's hitting the loop. He's slow down, slow down. Loop. He's hitting the loop. He's hitting the loop. Slow down, slow down. Oh, oh no, tongue slow, twister, slow, slow, slow. tongue twister. Oh, that's a tough one. We had to do retaking that. Yeah, one we need times. to rephrase it a little okay, bit. Okay, let's smooth that one out. That one, that one didn't quite make it super smooth in post. Great, perfect. Okay, here we go. Here good. we go. Yep. Good. Yep. Good. In the pocket. In the pocket. Up oh, me again. Me again. Okay. 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 Where are we at? Oh, pink, pink, pink. Okay, slow, slow, slow. It's a tough one. There's some uh, some technical jargon. Yep. Some, some names that he's not familiar with pronouncing or a little bit tricky to pronounce. Some questionable research in this one. Oh, uh -huh, yeah, yeah. I can't, can't really go forward with that one. Oh, can we do it? Yeah! All right. Cool. All right. We're in the corner. Okay. Yep. Okay, well, hello. Can I check it out? You check can it out. run away, but the smell of your pancreas will always draw me to you. <laughs> what the heck? Why? What the? Oh, hello. <gasps> Zoinks! Jumbo Josh! Oh, this veiny goodness! What are we, what are we doing? Oh, hello, Opila Bird. Oh, Whoa, okay, flop, flop. flop. Oh, there we go. Oh. oh, wow. Oh, oh! Did we just kill Ban Ban? Did we just kill Ban Ban? Oh! <laughs> Stick. Yeah. No! Yeah. Leave him alone! No, don't. He's a big boy. Oh. Oh, Jumbo Josh is going hard. You don't hurt Josh. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah. Jumbo Josh is a... Oh, no. Tartar bird. Tartar sauce bird. Tartan. Opila screaming in pain was oh, geez. very disturbing. It's... Oh, geez. Like, everyone's dead after this one. It's like everyone got into the brawl. <laughs> that's actually... That's actually Garden of Band Band 4. It's Super Smash Brothers Brawl. All the characters just against each other. Hey, bud. We got the baby. Find the kingdom. Find the sheriff. Do not let the jester find you. So the sheriff is Toadster. So we got to find Toadster. The kingdom. I don't know. And the jester, is that the half and half guy? Is that half and half? We have a little guy. Hey. Hey, hey bud. Cute. Is this our kid? Our son. Is this our son? Yeah. I think it might be. That's my guess. Cause now at this point. Oh the... wait, actually our son. Yeah, I'm wondering if this is actually the kid that we're looking for. That's I. It's a it's a reach. And it's a pure guess, just based on you know other IP and how narratives like this go or whatever. I could see it being. I was just like, yeah, I'd take this little guy in. Right, I'd take that little guy. Well, that... I know what's going on our wish list. <laughs> well, that was a game that existed. Let's wish list the sequel right here. Let's check this out. Oh, there's already a trailer for it and everything. Of course there is. Why not? Okay, there's the thing that we discovered. I'm assuming that's the jester.
Nice. <laughs> okay. Seat cushion. Love that. No, hat. It's, it's a hat. Yeah, it's a hat. Is that Toadster's hat, I'm assuming? Yeah. That's, that's the badge. And that's the Toadster badge. Okay. Great. Woo! Great. Excitement! <laughs> Garden of Bad Man. <laughs> what, what have we become? Wow. You know, there's a lot to chew on with that one, I gotta say. Yeah. A lot to think about. A lot to chew on. I think at this point, I can't deny. I, I, like, at this, I've, I've been dancing around, like, do we do a theory about Garden of Man? Do we not? Like, I think at this point, we kind of have to. We simply must. We simply must. Simply. L simply. <laughs> the, the internet demands it. Yeah. You demand it, you know. The universe demands it, it. it right? It's it's our duty. It would be inappropriate for not to, for us to move forward without doing a, a theory. It would be a one. gosh darn disrespect. Right. Wow. Well, stay tuned, ladies and gentlemen, for the Garden of Man Man theory that's going to come one of these days. Because uh, to be honest, I need a I need to go and refresh myself on literally everything that's going on. Do we even have a remote idea of what's going on? Like. Kids are being brought in. They're doing exp there's there's DNA genome experiments happening. They're creating these new creatures to you know in a poppy playtime style like run the operation of this place. But it's not doing great. But some of the bigger questions about like what's what's the big face guy? What's going on in the deeper levels? Is this alien? Is this just purely human creation? I don't know. So we you know literally everything that Stinger Flynn said got to parse all that. I have no idea what he's talking about. So anyway. There you have it, the masterpiece that is Garden of Ban Ban 3. Um, what a roller coaster of emotion that one was. Uh, but we did it. Teleprompter training worked out. Nailed it. We got a boss battle. Mm -hmm. All sorts of gameplay sequences. It's, it's kind of crazy. So Anything. anyway, thank you guys so much for joining us on this wild ride. Let us know your theories down in the comments because I'll be very curious to see what you think of this whole thing. And, uh, you know... As always, my friends, remember, it wasn't a live stream, but it was a video. Video for you. See ya.